works. Hello, everyone. We're back, delayed, but it's fine. We're here. Good or no. <laughs> Again, getting an ad on my own yeah. fucking channel. Same. <laughs> what? Yeah, but you're I not know, subscribed. I, I you don't, don't count. Get ads. You're making money. Yes, of it, indeed. Lars. I'm making the full 0 0.35 cents. 0 0.7 mm -hmm. cents. It's hey. too easy. One more, and then we have a cent that we can put to our name. Let's go. Anyway, welcome back. Woo. Sorry about the delay. That's all on me. Don't blame them. Blame them for, for all the much. other shit that happens in this campaign, because that's all their fault. <laughs> Lars, I'm slightly creepy zoomed in. That is... Uh, <laughs> that might be my fault, yes. <laughs> I think that will be better. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Maybe we should all be like that. I, I, I want I want to here. How is this? Is it is it, is this a good? <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine doing the entire stream like that? Uh Anyway, because I'm still trying to gather my thoughts, I'm going to throw it over to our master of announcements, Yella, to start this off. <laughs> yes, no announcements today. I want to get into into D and D. It has to be so. <laughs> <laughs> it will be. I was playing. I want to get into league. Okay. Um, yeah. So who's going I, mid? I, 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 actually, I, actually, I have an announcement. Oh, oh shit! I have, I have two. 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 Well, first off is uh, obviously I have finally left my work, <laughs> and I'm extremely happy about it. Yay. And second, that while I'm waiting for certain things to happen before I move. Um, well, I've got all this free time. I intend to start streaming again. Oh, oh shit. Hmm. I just need to figure out what I want to stream first and go from there. Make a legend. No. <laughs> it won't be that. Okay, good. I, that, I, was, I, I, that was the only correct and good answer. <laughs> <laughs> no, so, yeah, so, so, yeah, so keep an eye out for uh, Zalmanar on Twitch. Maybe I'll be streaming. I died, I died. Hmm. Shameless self plug, but anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Don't yeah. forget to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and prescribe. Prescribe. Yeah, yeah, this is a prescription. Prescription of stream. There, there is a reference there, and some people get it. But anyway, with that into, in, in mind, and because uh, Yella is getting anxious to die <clears throat> i mean play um let's get back into it shall we yes so last time I we killed no idea the plant, what happened last demonic plant and then you met a skull with a gem for an eye mm -hmm. and i wasn't okay. there for it and it looked so cool on the fucking stream when yes. i watched it it was, was such a, a shame yeah you missed something was there. Yeah. soul trader for magical items yeah, you oh, can oh, safely yeah. assume oh, that oh, I also got, like ha like had one of the flasks things to yes. do the yeah. sucking up thing. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You would, you would. Yeah. It would have been five of them. Yeah. yeah. Well, so, so in short, we harvest souls and we get magical items in return, which yeah. are not uh, cursed, but which are shadow items. Yep. And they are frowned upon. Yeah, which means anytime right, so someone would try to detect the magic, they would notice that, uh, like, you're not going to be able to figure it out by looking at it. You're not going to be able to figure it out with an Arcana check. You do need to specifically be looking for magic. Uh, even detect something magic like the Paladin's, like Divine Sense wouldn't work on it, but it's actually something oh. like Detect Magic. Uh, but that would allow immediately give off an aura of, like, shit, this is not... This was not Good. created properly. Let me put it like that. Yes. Question: Has yes. Any, has anyone already tested whether or not a bag of holding conceals such magic? No. Like if we were to put in like a, a shadow idea. item, put in a normal bag of holding, mm -hmm. and just we, have, we haven't it. got one to test it with. So. Yeah. Um. I mean, to be fair, you have a Jed with you who has very high intelligence, and I'm just gonna tell you this. The thing is, the item would be held within a different dimensional plane. Uh, I don't think you can even yeah. detect the items within the bag of holding, just in general. Yeah. So if you would put it inside of a bag of holding, probably wouldn't. They would probably not yeah. be able to detect it. If the bag of holding is a shadow item, then you're still fucked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but... 
Yeah. That would defeat a little, that, that that would defeat the purpose a little bit. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Okay. Good to know. Maybe we can just like search for a shadow. bag of holding then somewhere. That is a possibility, definitely. I or, mean, we already have one. Just saying. Yeah, but you know, it's kind of in the hands of uh, Laku, I think. So. Yeah. I'm up like would. a personal one to put like my own like shadow shit into them. Are, if I are, are we saying that we trust El Valkyrie with your shit? I mean, <laughs> yeah, I mean, no, that's why I say what my own. Well, well, technically, I do own mo uh, some of it as well, but I help pay for it. Do you still own? <laughs> Does he know oh. that you own it as well? I mean, I mean, I I could probably take it off her, and she wouldn't notice. Yeah, I was about to say, like, Sekura could probably just stealth her way to stealing it. It's like this is mostly mine. Yoink, yoink. But yeah, that was. Uh, I think that's where we left off last time. Yeah, and Rayu, we have a free wizard tower if you want. You do have to rebuild it, and yeah. same like rebuild as in actually rebuild it. A free yeah. wizard ruin. Yes, indeed. Yeah, Which small problem. We still need to like fix the keep, so it's like a lot of money issues that, that we have. So the, the keep, keep is being is paid for. Fixed for free, right? But you do have a debt to a coin maker. Man. Yeah, also very important. I like my soul, you know. So True. that seems like a you problem, not a me problem. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, uh, unless you guys still want to ask something to Art the cart, nope. uh, you see. Arts drive away off into the, I'd say the sunset, but that doesn't really uh, go with it. Um, if I'm not mistaken, you guys were traveling from the southern settlement to the eastern settlement, which was about a day and a half. And I think this was the second encounter roll that you guys did, because the first one didn't do anything. Yeah. you got lucky. So you would technically arrive uh, late at night on this day. Uh, so it'd be like, well, late at night, let's say 8-ish, something like that, uh, in the evening. You would arrive in a settlement, and it'd be very similar to the previous two that you've seen. It's just a small settlement. There's a decent amount of people in there, and they're living their uh, lives. Uh, the difference between the this one and the previous one is there's no giant motherforking plant there. <laughs> Which, you know, we're not... So it has to... a working wizard tower that isn't fucked. Uh, I can neither confirm nor deny. Do you want to look for a wizard tower? Yeah. Uh, also, another question, uh, mostly uh, from the previous session. Would there have been any amount of hours that I could have spent working on my tattoo at all? Uh, I think the answer to that question was yes. I don't remember how many anymore. F. Because I think I you guys took uh, one long rest in the city and then you left. So um, uh, I, think, I, I think I got some done. I think... Six hours? Yeah, but you probably took four from because you have like four less sleep than I do, so I would probably have two then, I think. Yeah, let's say two, for reasons sake. Right. Uh, and as well, you lost the lingering point of exhaustion. Yes, indeed. That as well. Because within the city, you did get... Oh yeah, the, really the, good. I had four of them. Yeah, now exactly. So now you only have three. Yeah, <laughs> yeah still slightly fucked, by the way. Um, yeah, but, still tired yeah. as shit. Yeah. So the next creature also does lingering points of exhaustion. Uh, <laughs> six kills you, right? Um, hey, I'm still getting over my real life exhaustion. Mm -hmm. I get that. five my points. Speed currently is um. Half. Half. Wait, does the flat happen first or first the halving? What? I get a minus ten because of my armor, and I have a halved because of the. Whichever one is better for you, because I'm a nice DM. Woo! I think that means uh, I now have 10 movement speed still. Yes. Which is the best case scenario. Yes. <laughs> I'm slow. Help. You have 10 feet of movement speed right now. That is hilarious. Technically, that would mean you would need more days to travel, but I'm not going to do that to you people. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. They can carry me. Yeah. With no. armor? <laughs> Big question. I mean, to be fair, I would just take off my armor so that I would have at least like twenty speed movement, yeah, like twenty feet movement. Then I guess. Yeah, it's fine. No, yeah, no you'd still well, technically, then you'd go to fifty. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if I'd be a dick about it, no, it's fine. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna hold that against you. Uh, but yeah, you currently have disadvantage on ability checks, saving throws, and attack rolls, and you have half movement speed. So just so you know. Please. All right. We're almost 
as useless as El Fakri. <laughs> <laughs> God. Fair. Uh, but anyway, so you guys do arrive uh, at the settlement gates. I don't know. It's not really a gate. It's an open area. Uh, you see a couple of houses. You see several people walking around. Um, you do notice that the population here seems to consist more of like a couple of dwarves, more of orcs, more of bugbears, like kind of uh those kinds of races um you know there's a couple of humans in there there's a couple of elves in there stuff like that but you know you get the sense that there's like they're mostly like you would say like every 10 people let's say like four of them are like dwarves and then the other six are like different are like split between all the other races ah, um, so the stone mining settlement is filled with dwarves it's almost like i'm using cliches because that's easy wow. yes so that uh Followers can follow. So yeah. Um, so with that in mind, you people would, you know, reach the edge of the settlement. Okay. Let's. What do you want to do? Deep. Go on, Ryu. We are Get... the saviors. Yeah, saviors, my ass. I need a nap. Really bad. Yeah, the heroes I'm so fucking tired. My fucking legs, man. You don't understand. Okay. <clears throat> We can be the, the saviors in approximately three days. <laughs> <laughs> three day nap. <laughs> yes. Uh, Two days is probably fine. Yeah. I will start off on the wrong foot with the dwarves because that's my character. Mm -hmm. I'm going to say, aha, good evening, little fellow. Good evening, giant lamp lamppost. Oh, it's fine as well. Um, we are on a bit of a round trip from Alvarest to the uh, three settlements because we freed Alvarest. Hooray! Hurrah! Congratulations! Thank you! And um, we were seeing if anything was wrong in your settlement, like any demons haunting your dreams, any like cows being slaughtered yeah like there's a giant there. lamppost that's come to life and is now talking to me i'm like oh, slowly no. walking to the dwarf and i like hand him a gold coin and i just ask him where's the most comfortable inn well if you go a couple of hundred feet over that way you'll find a, a giant like building with a fucking pickaxe attached to it uh they use that both as a miner's outlet and uh say uh well, as, a, as an in for those people, you're not going to get a discount unless you work in the mine, though. No That's offense. fine. Good night, buddy. And I just walk towards the inn. <laughs> you literally see Ryu just, like, slumped over. Yes. <clears throat> okay. I, I, just as he walks past, I just take my foot out. <laughs> Make I'm a dexterity gonna... saving. <laughs> Do I? I mean, it's with this advantage. Do... <sighs> I'm just gonna fucking sleep on the floor, I guess. I don't know. Actually, no, I really <laughs> no. need to get rid of my fucking points of exhaustion. So. Yeah, because yes. that's not gonna heal your like, yeah. damage. Yeah, right, let's see. Technically, if, I, if, if I'm a <laughs> dick, then technically this place doesn't count as a safe location yet. Uh, <laughs> I'll keep him safe. <laughs> well, uh... Ah! See... Oh, oh, sorry, Ryu, I couldn't resist. You see the dwarf <laughs> actually just looking? Save the Alvarez, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yes. I'm very fucking impressed, and I totally believe what you're saying right now. Anywho, do you have, like, yeah, a mayor? Like, pull that dagger and put it in his throat if he wants, but... Yeah. Yeah, no, it's fine. Or someone who runs this place. Uh, you're probably going to want to talk to Broomrig. Okay. And where can you find this Broomrig fellow? The same location that I just sent your little friend to, honestly, probably. He's probably drinking himself to death. Yeah, on, the, on the floor? Oh, no, no, like... I'm oh, I didn't like send your fucking friend to the floor. I'm like... Okay, it was funny. Now it's just, now it's just pathetic. I'll, I'll, I'll grab Ryu by the arm and start dragging Yeah, because I'm... Fit, <laughs> I'm just like assuming because I can't like properly walk in my heavy armor that I'm just fucking glued to the floor at this point, so I, I can't get up properly without help. I'm, I'm just gonna drag him. You see Shiloh just like chuckling to herself. 
<laughs> because I know that's what she'd be doing. Yeah, it, was, it started funny, but now it's just sad. Yeah. Thank you for your directions. Uh, Alright, make sure you keep the light on. Because I'm lamppost. I get it. Because I'm smart. Uh, hey, he gets hey. it. He gets it. <laughs> That's funny. I don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, well, let's head to the end. I mean, te technically, we're already heading there, but it's very slow. Yeah. <laughs> just dragging him across the floor. You could just help me up instead, you know? Oh. No. Oh. Lars, is yes. there a slab of stone somewhere? Definitely. Yes. Nice. They're called I would houses. Like to... <laughs> are you going to drop it on my head? No, there's probably like some slabs of stone as well. Okay. Right there. But before the lamppost dude walks away, mm. I'm just going to like stone shape a statue of him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Five feet tall, so it's like life-sized statue there. Okay, in any particular position, or just standing there? Power pose. <laughs> no tipo. Yeah. Just, just like a just, just, just like a model that hasn't properly fucking like loaded in yet. Yeah. God damn it! He's found the glitches in my world. Shit. <laughs> Complete, completely neutral face. No, yeah. no expressions whatsoever. Like, all of a sudden, you just see the T-pose, and just all of a sudden, it, like, disappears, and you just hear someone like, Fuck, these fucking models just won't stay in place. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, meta. Get off. Ta-da. And then the world gets reloaded, and we all fucking go back to our previous save point. Uh, which was back in Elverest, right? So you start oh. over against uh, Sanguine. <laughs> no, no art. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, it wait, no, hang on. <laughs> oh, no go. wars. Woohoo. So we're just uh, uh, right. we are the Oh, there we go. Charlo, stop t posing now. Yeah. <laughs> we are now the heroes of our time. Oh, whoops. Rai was Alvakri and Alvakri is Rai. <clears throat> well, that's oh. just offensive. I know. Big I problem with the teleportation. About half of you nightmares tonight, if I want Good. to. Uh, please don't. I just started a new job. I need to be. <laughs> Liam and Lars, I can give you instant nightmares. Okay. Oh, no. okay, you have one sentence. Gable manager. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Yeah. No, no, I just rebuilt my computer. I don't want to have to see that shit again. <laughs> oh, thank God for modular, uh, yeah, modular power supplies, though, because yeah. I remember the, the days of the hybrid ones when that was the best you could you could get. Uh, anyway, um, as I was saying, so um, you're all going to the tavern. And, yes. Go on, I'll talk to you in the yeah. tavern. <clears throat> Is uh, there gambling? Always. There's always Probably. gambling. That's literally a rule in this world. People are so fucking depressed that they don't care anymore. <laughs> Gamble away. Yeah, got it. Exactly. Check. Ga gamble their soul away. Wait, that is, might also is, be a thing. Is, is this consonant England? I plead the fifth on that. <laughs> Sounds like it. Um, but anyway, as you walk up to this, you actually see this like relatively large building, uh, mostly made of stone, and then probably fixed with stone because you see like one wall is like you know old, and then you see like a piece of wall that's completely new. You see a part of the wall that's like completely old again, and then you see a newer, newer part of the wall. It's like it's almost like every single time something goes to shit in this building, they fix it with stone. Um, mm -hmm. So you know, fancy. Mm. And you notice that, like, uh, you have, like, the front door, which is probably the one part of this building that's not made of stone, uh, but there is a giant pickaxe that's, like, kind of used as the handle of the door that's, like, just through the wood. Huh. Uh, which is, is also us. where the name comes from, uh, the uh, the axe and drinks. Because how the cool. fuck not? How does that work for the door, though? So is it just, like, two pickaxes? Like, one on each side, or how does it... It's a single door, and you can just, like... Take the pickaxe and pull it open. Yeah, yeah. But what if you want to? I, I, I would imagine if you want to get out, then you have to just push it, I guess. Then. I would imagine the pickaxe head sure. is going through the other side. So. Yeah. You've got the handle mm, on one yeah. side, then you've got the the head on the other. 
Try to imagine it yourself, Ryu. I'm not going to do everything for you. <laughs> oh, yeah. I just want to make sure, you know? Yeah, I get it. It's fine. Consistency. Consistency. Yeah. But yeah, mm. there's a decent amount of people that you can immediately hear who are drinking their sorrows away and gambling their sorrows away within the uh, tavern itself. It... Around on me. Forget how much can it cost. It's something to yell if you come in. Bartender, around on me. You see, you see this like long, just human gentleman kind of standing there, looks at you. You seem like kind of trying to do math in his head. You can round up. It's fine. Ten gold pieces. Make it two rounds on me. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. 15 gold pieces. 15 gold fine. pieces. 20 is fine. It's mad. <laughs> uh, we he's also a, had he's a generous tipper. Yeah. We also had 821 gold pieces from last session. So it's like. Oh yeah. yeah. Wait, split Cut. already or still two yeah, split? Yeah, split already. That was already split. Yeah. Wait, how much? 821. Yes. Or 801. I have, if you I like. have. Oh. Actually, no, weirdly enough, I actually have exactly the amount I have in real life right now. Which is Nothing. zero. <laughs> no. Oh, wait, nope, never mind. Uh, massively wrong. I, Are you I can't, also I can't be... indebted to the coin maker in real life? <laughs> uh, no, because in real life, I actually throttled the bastard. <clears throat> that would be funny as shit, though. But yeah, uh, you dr drinks are being tossed around the room. Hey, woo, for hey. uh, no, I'd like to, I'd like it to stay in in the mug. I don't want a throne. Uh, that seems Unless, like uh, it, that uh, seems like a you problem, not a me problem. <laughs> do they have a? Is there a funnel available? Yes. Okay, cool. Okay, yeah, chuck it at me. Chug, 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 chug. The moment you see Sequita just sitting there, you see like about ten, like you see like six of those people just like sitting there, just kind of like looking at one another, and you see like coin kind of like forming on the table as if they're making a bet on like how fast is she gonna be like slammed. Sequita can drink. Come on. I know. They don't know that. They see a dainty elf. Oh, dainty. Thank you. <laughs> You're very welcome. So, I asked to the first person next to me. So, who of you fellows is a uh, Um, you just see this this like person kind of like looks at you, kind of like points to the edge of the room where you see this like actually pretty large for for a dwarf kind of like sitting there kind of still has like a pickaxe in the at the at the back of his thing like this minor cap on him kind of like just sitting there you notice that there's already like four empty cups there and he's like just gotten his fifth one because of someone ordering you know drinks for all the round yes. uh and he's just sitting there like kind of picks up the mug and just like yep. <laughs> Okay. I was trying to burp and it went in the wrong direction. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it threw up instead. Yeah, indeed. Yo. Thank you. That was exactly what I needed. Who was that? Liam. Yeah, that, that was me. I can do I can burp on command. So. Alright, Liam, here's a bullshit point. Point for no. Uh... <laughs> no, you do not get a bullshit point for burping, you get a bullshit point for burping at the right moment. Best burper of the UK, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, anyway. Okay. So you see this this dwarf kind of like sitting there. Just okay. shucks. So it's a uh, pause bedtime for Ryu. So goodbye, yeah. Ryu. <laughs> Ryu's gonna like finish like one drink and then just fucking leave the other one on the table for whoever the fuck wants to pick it up and then go straight to fucking his... Uh, well, I don't know. I want to like fucking his hire... Room. like. Like rent a room. How much is that? When I ask the the barkeep, uh, be technically five silver. No, I want to get the most comfortable room possible. Be five silver because they're uh, all shit. Well, f. 
But I asked the guy for the most comfortable inn, and he fucking... Is this the most most comfortable inn? Probably really. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> what a shit place is this shit? Yes. <laughs> All right, well, I hand them five silver, and I fucking go upstairs. And I hand him the fucking drink that I got, because I finished one, and I'm going to give him the other one, and take the key or whatever, and just plonk into the bed as soon as possible to get rid of the... Take off my uh, armor. I'm, I'm just there. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Is that a free drink? I love that, thank you. <laughs> He, like you see the bartender kind of like trying to take a drink, at which point Sequoia just takes it from his hand, and he's just like, oh, "Fuck!" <laughs> just walks away. Poor bartender, Sequoia. It seems like Brumrick is more of your type, you know, the drinker, the brooder. You should go talk to him. What do we want from him? I don't know. <laughs> Fi- finding out what's wrong with this place so that we can fix it. <laughs> I get Why it. are you assuming it's that cool. there's something wrong with this place? Okay, ask him what we need to do to get their support in the war. But don't mention that it's a full-scale war. Mention that it's a small brawl. So we need we need help in the war, but I need to not mention the war. <laughs> yes. yes. Right. Okay. So. Uh, and your best diplomatic behavior. How about you make a persuasion check with this bitch? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, me or him? You, Sekura. You, you're, you're the oh, right. I, I, I thought he was trying to convince me to do that. Uh, oh, no. no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, he didn't need to. Uh, persuasion. Come on, Sequida. Yes, my disadvantage with minus one. <laughs> Might not be the What's worst. Uh, uh-huh. It's it's well, it's not the worst, but it's getting there. <laughs> so what 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 are you, what are you what are you saying to him, Sequida? All right. Yeah. Uh, so uh, hang on, I need the prop. So, uh, Mister Br- uh, Mister Broom Handle. Um, you see what you see. You see them over there. I used to know their names. I've forgotten them now. Um, but <laughs> the, there's there's some there's some people that that we don't like, and we want to fuck them up. Do you want to help? <laughs> nice. He's not wrong. Nice. The dwarf kind of like looks back at you. Oh, f- I'll fuck up whoever the fuck you want. God fucking damn it. I'll, I'll put me axe up there, Jimmy's. Which is funny because I don't like Jimmy. Jimmy's an asshole. Yeah, fuck, fuck, fuck Jimmy. Um, yeah, no, Jimmy fucked my wife. So I fucking hate Jimmy. Oh, wow. <laughs> I, 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 I can kill him if you want. You want me to kill him? Yeah, no, I like that idea. <laughs> All right, uh, I'll get, I'll get on it tomorrow. Uh, do you want another drink? Let's drink another drink. We need another drink. Yes, another drink. Another or two other or four. Or... I mean, it depends. It depends on how big they are. Seven hundred. <laughs> they're dwarfs, so they're probably like a half a liter pints at least. Yes. Yeah, pretty I much. Ordered. It's like the German okay. beer, like you know. Yeah. yeah. I, I ordered yeah, another uh, five drinks. Oh, uh, f- 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 thank you, Jim. Yeah, Four yeah. for the two of them, and then like sit on the at the table with another one. Uh, 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 ego, um, Rummy, is 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 your drink? Is your drink? The, the, oh, these two, no, that that the, these two are mine. I, I I paid for them, didn't I? Didn't I, Jed? That, that yes, was, yes, uh, it definitely did. You, you yeah, kind of yeah, see yeah. the dwarf kind of like looking at Jed, like, "Who the fuck did you bring a lamp post into this building?" <laughs> oh, you yeah, know, he 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 bright he he brightens up the day. Ah, uh, I don't wow. know. Lamp posts can walk. Yeah. Oh no 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 this this, this one. He, 
he, he's he's a, he's a special lamppost. He, he's a good one. Uh, oh, he can he he can make it seem like he's not a lamppost. It's that it's he's that good. Uh, he, he, like you see the dwarf kind of like going over to Chet and like he like puts out his hand and like tries to pet you, yes. but you know he's like literally doing it next to you because he's drunk. Uh, it's like, and I stop concentrating on my demonic arm so that it turns demonic, <laughs> and then like start concentrating on it again. Holy shit, this is a nice lamppost trick. Yes. <laughs> lamppost camouflage. Oops, the mother of God. So, Brumerick, what's the deal with you? Is there a demon haunting your mind? There's always something haunting the mind. Fuck the mind. Last time people went in there, no one came out! Huh. It's, Unlike it's, it's, Jimmy it's the... and your wife. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, he didn't come out either. I don't know if he had... came oh, out dude. at this point. They've been spending the last three hours there. I don't know how many times. Uh, uh. Right, okay. So so we need to go and fuck a mine and kill a Jimmy. Oh. Yes! <laughs> so where right. does Jimmy fuck live? Jimmy. I mean, what? <laughs> no, we need kill a mine and fuck a Jimmy. Uh, no, Elvakri, that's your job. You can do the first bit. We'll Brumrik, he's a shitty person, but does he have a soul? Uh, uh, mm. is looking. I have no oh, idea. Sir, you said that. Mm-hmm. He yeah. seems like a uh, soul is uh, bastard to me. There. No. <laughs> no. Okay, okay. Bad lab post. Bad lab post. No, no. bad lab post. And he kind of like, like kind of like just this, trying to like give you a like a yes. slap, and it just completely misses. Yes. Okay. So, do you want us to go check the mine to see what happens there? What happened there? I have fun. But if you don't come <laughs> out, it's not on me. Okay. And if we do come out, you help fuck us up, whoever we want. If you come out and fuck up Jimmy. Yes. You'll fuck up Jimmy. You'll never sleep with your wife again. Exactly. I don't know how, but we'll make it work. He, he, he won't make... He, he won't... He, uh, he won't... I'll cut his dick off. Uh, I'm going to bed. Excuse me? <laughs> it's actually a good idea. Yes. But you didn't get that from me. Okay. Uh, so, where does Jimmy live? And where is your mind? With my wife! <laughs> where where does your wife, wife live? With Jimmy! <laughs> okay. <laughs> we'll, come, we'll come back is, to that later. Are we, are, we'll, we'll are we sure that it's like still his wife at this point? Like, if they live together? <laughs> yeah, but no, no, the like... plot, plot twist. He is Jimmy. Yeah, <laughs> and he's sleeping with someone else's wife. <laughs> Ooh, Jimmy called tips. So, and where is the mine? <laughs> well, it's, so, if you travel a little bit east, it's like the eastern side of the city. Yes. It's like giant maws seems to open out of the ground. It's a mine. A mine. Uh, and is and the mine yours? Mine. Yes, the mine is mine. So, it's not a mine, it's a tomb. <laughs> There's people who never came out. I totally didn't do that for a Lord of the Rings reference. <laughs> so, uh, and how, how deep is the mine? It's not that, not that deep. It, you Me. know, we, it actually, it's, an, it's a fun mine. Okay. It's weird, it's like it grows its own stone. The stone grows back. Wow. It's not that That's... deep. Unlike, Unlike the Jimmy! Jimmy. <laughs> Pretty sure I've seen this in a Star Trek episode, and everyone gets stuck in the stone. Yes. Yes. I think there's more okay. people who got stone in the stuck. I think that's actually in several different Star Trek series. <laughs> Very probable. So, um, nice meeting you. Yes. Will you just like sign this napkin where I wrote down, you will help fuck us up whoever you want, 
out of your own volition. And kind of like puts his hand somewhere to kind of like try to find something to write with. Think of it, take this pencil. So what, I mean, you have like a million bottles, bottles of ink on you, don't take, you? Take, I mean, take, yeah. takes, his, takes a pencil and kind of like slams it on the table and just starts signing okay. the table for a second. Yes. yes. It kind of like keeps going. Oh. Well, well, while this is going on, I've decided not to go to Jim, bed. Jim. I'm going to slam a gold piece on the bar and then walk behind the bar and pour myself a pint. Nice. Perfect. Brimrick, you're also looking a little bit down on your luck. Would you want to become... Most... You're a dick. I am a dick. <laughs> More lucky again? Uh... Or even better, what are the others? What are the others? Yes. Yes. I'll actually yes. Have, have a look as well and see. It's yes. been a while since I took a look at it. Where is it again? Um, uh, Demon War GM, but you're sleeping. Uh, yeah, but I'm just going to take a look. Like, what's, Do you what want to have unsurpassed fortune? <laughs> yes. I want just to have you. unprepared yes. fortunes. Yes, great. Just sign here, Jimmy. Uh, just sign here, Brimrick. <laughs> His name's Broomhandle. Yes, my name's Broomhandle. Hey, your Broomhandle. I'm lamppost. Nice. And he just like starts signing the contract. Do you have golden ink? Yes, I have two two bottles of them. Two, okay, cool. Two vials of fancy ink. golden oh, ink that I woke up with. Okay, perfect. Just like signs it. Nice. Great. Now I have another one. Another victim. Yes. Another. Uh, okay. Greta now actually tries to find the wherever the rooms are. Okay. Yes. Uh, she's pulled the, she's pulled one. She's actually pulled like two. But she drops one on the floor. Next, the other one. Like, uh, I'm out. Oh, I'm good. You see the barkeep looking at you very angrily. So, Shallow, you want to gamble? Mm. Yep. Want to gamble? Gambling. Want to gamble? Yeah. yeah. Go and gambling. Interested. Go and gambling. You see, like, a table where there's a couple of people playing, like, a dice game. Look at shit. I'm going in. Hmm. What are we going to gamble for, Shallow? Just gold pieces or something exotic? <laughs> Glory God. I mean, gold pieces, duh. Yes. Duh. God. I, I, yeah. How many people are at the table? Uh, four. Okay. Six drinks. One for Shadow and myself and two did. And then let's head to the table, put some drinks down and ask them. So, people, what are we playing? Playing dice. Great. My name is Lamppost. This is Shadow. We want to play with you. Buy into 25 gold pieces. Oh, damn. Okay. Pretty high stakes to start with. Yeah. All right. Okay. What am I uh, rolling? Actually, let me check if I have money. <laughs> yeah. Money. I got have money 821 money. gold pieces at least. Yeah, you have 821 gold pieces. <sighs> Oh, did I win that? Because I have the I have so, added it. So, okay, so, eight hundred and twenty-one on top of what I already have yeah. is one thousand fifty-eight. Oh damn! You looted it. Yeah, that's the advantage of not being here. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> you all of a sudden have money. <laughs> There's no in between. I mean, uh, I'm, I've always been there. And I've got money, and I've <laughs> and I've paid like several thousands of the coin maker. Yep. Hey. I like had magical ink as well as uh, the feast and all the rest. Sure. Mm. Um, okay, so Jed, Chilo, roll five d6s. Nice. Okay. Um, so, oh, Christ. Ooh, but like, uh, I'm still using this horrible fucking. Someone do it for me. <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll do it. So it's different. Okay. Five. Oh, I'm, I'm, be, because I'm lazy, I'm just going to only roll two because I'm legitimately lazy. 
What, what's going on? Are they, are they gambling? Yes. Yes. Uh. Okay. So, <clears throat> um, yeah, you get to choose a several number of dices and then uh, re-roll them. That happens two times. And then at the end, we're going to do an intelligence gambling tools check. And the one who gets the highest gets to re-roll two dice. Second highest gets to re-roll one. Okay. Uh, I'm checking, guys. I am re-rolling the one and the two. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Okay. I'm re-rolling the ones and the two. Okay. So keeping the five and the six. All right. Oh uh, dear. Liam. Holy shit. Thank you. Oh dear. Ooh. Holy shit. A lot of force. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm keeping the force. So, so you can't have keep the five, force. The force so, is everywhere. So Jed has uh, four, 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 yeah. five, six, and Shiloh has four, four, five, five, six. Okay. Yes. I'm keeping the force. Uh, yeah. Fuck. May the force be with you. Yes. Hmm. Wait, just what, was the, what was the other one for? Okay. Okay. Actually, I forgot to ask this. Does anyone want to bet more money than the 25 Ooh. that's already in the pot? Not at all. Was there any I'm... more rolling needed for Shadow? Yes. Uh, in a second, one more, yeah. I'm checking all the way through. Okay. Trello, you too? You re-rolled the one and the two so far, so you're five five four four six. Yes. Or six five five four four. Do I re-roll the six or not? Because at the moment I have a double pair with a high six. Yes. yes. I'm looking for the full. Fuck it. Yeah, I'm re roll the six. Please no. Okay. Uh, we rolling sixes. That's the only time you're ever gonna fucking hear that. Oh, oh. and it's a four. Oof. You love to see it. Oof. So four, 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 five, five. Ooh, full house. Full house. Holy shit. Okay. <coughs> oh, damn. And then, uh, I'm just quickly gonna re-roll one die. I mean, there's no way he loses this. And then uh, re-roll. I feel better hands to Lord. There's still like the intelligence check to yep. so, re-roll die. I, just, um, I don't think he's gonna re-roll anything from this. Yeah. No, I'm not not no, re-rolling sure. anything. No. Honestly, these guys are not re-rolling anything any either. So, Jed, unless hey. you want to roll one re-roll one die. Yeah. Okay, everybody, make an intelligence gambling tool check. I think so, I'll. Oh, um... natural twenty. So, no. does anyone have a plus five or higher on their other I mean, I also rolled a natural 20 on one of them, but he doesn't have the same bonus that you do, so. Thank God. Two D6, so right? Seven. You get to re roll up to two dice, yes. Okay, so I re roll my two and my five. God damn it. Four, 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 one, six. Yep. Okay. All right. Um, I'm not so, re rolling. Yeah. Oh, so you didn't even need to roll the. the in, in, no. So. Okay. Uh, just ballad and dumb. Jed, you reveal <laughs> dumb. three of a kind. Uh, not bad, not bad. Shiloh, you reveal full house of fours and fives, mm -hmm. which is very important because the other twos that I rolled have a full house of threes and twos and a full house of Ooh. fours and threes. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. You're welcome, dude. So, so Shiloh wins win. 75 gold pieces. No, uh, no, wait, sorry. 125 gold pieces. Hopla. Because I was just lazy and I didn't roll four sets. Come on, Shiloh. Yeah, I yeah we're, we're going again. I mean, duh. I mean, I usually do like one game with higher stakes just so that we don't like spend the entire night. This is like uh, a longer period of time where he's winning I or she's go. winning. I, think I need to disable Bigsby on my cell phone. <laughs> yeah, so do I. I don't know how. Be be because it's just lying here, and I was talking about gambling to you guys, and I was like, ah, I'm going to search for that shit. Like, no, <laughs> don't search for gambling sites, you fucking dick. Uh, oh, gambling sites. I did 100 euros. <laughs> <laughs> 125 gold pieces. Yeah, and then we go to bed, I suppose. Yeah. Meanwhile, Ryu, 
This is like over I, a longer period of time where you like, you know, play for a while and you get a decent chunk of fucking money out of it. Ta da! Damn it. Um, um, so, uh, Ryu's not going to be happy with this because technically this place is not yes. under your domain yet. Yes. Oh, so it's not treated as a safe long rest. I. Shit happens. For, for, for the first time in a while, Sagrida actually sleeps. Nice. Out of necessity, because knocked out. Yes. <laughs> because, because drunk. Yeah. It's the only time she ever sleeps. <laughs> when drunk. Um, at well, which point, F. you get to the uh, following morning. I, I do gain, like, spell slots and stuff, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You still get the benefits of a long rest, just not a safe long rest. It's, uh, it's, it's something. But the benefit of being an elf? No hangovers. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sekuda, as you come downstairs, you actually do off. see like the guy who, who was talking about the mine like long out of the, over on the floor. Like <laughs> <laughs> uh dwarves. They try so hard. Yeah. But they just can't be an elf when it comes to drinking. Look how high they need uh, to uh, jump to mimic a fraction of our height. Oh. <laughs> 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 Uh, 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 I'm sorry, dwarves. It's nothing personal. Uh, yes, it is. No, it's <laughs> not actually. Oh, wait, just... no, no, no. You're talking about dwarves. I mean, I thought I thought someone mentioned gnomes. <laughs> no, I was already uh, sharpening the sacrificing knife. <laughs> oh, damn. Uh, gnomes, dwarves. What's next? Halflings. Halflings. <laughs> no. <laughs> I mean, never sacrifice the dwarves. Have you ever tried to put them on a pyre? Those beards stink, man. <laughs> oh, they make they make excellent cannonballs. If you are ever in shortage of <laughs> cannonballs, yeah. don't tell this to anyone. But no. show me. <laughs> they are almost don't completely round, Lars. It's like you just shove them. I know on. that's not the correct line, but you know you uh, get the gist. Okay, oh. so let's head east, I suppose. Pretty sure Liam would be able to quote the correct line. Uh, what? The one about Gimli being thrown. Don't tell the elf. Not a oh. word. Oh, right. <laughs> right, yeah. that's the one. Yeah. Thank you, Lars. Not You're welcome. Word. Can't make the distance, you'll have to toss me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I'm still happy, even though it was from a distance, I got to see John Reese davis at Comic Con Brussels last year, so nice. So as you um, travel east, yes. I mean, you've seen this village at this point. It's not that much bigger. It takes a little bit to get there, less than like half an hour, I'd say, because it's a little right. bit out of outside of the the settlement, yes. of course. And it's they call it a mine, <laughs> a mine. <laughs> So it's pretty much it's just like this large open like hole and you can kind of like go descend into it, uh, so to okay. speak. Okay. It is dark. Who, yes. who has, does not have dark vision? I have dark vision, but I have uh, like disadvantage on sight in general. Nice. You have disadvantage on everything at the moment, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If I have disadvantage on sight as well, but only in real life. You know what? So do I. Mm. Yeah. Luckily, we have these uh, common magical items that uh, are very easy to buy, and uh, yeah, they don't even require attunement. They're great. Easy to buy, yeah. really? <laughs> Actually, you know what? When you, when you first get one, they do need a bit of attunement, a couple of days. Yeah, and, and then and then you're fine. Then it's fine. Yeah, but it doesn't take up one of your slots, so it's, it's kind of yeah. No, good point. Good point. It's like a special version. Wow. Fine, I'll give you bullshit points. Jesus. <laughs> 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 Uh, D&D references oh. in the Let's go. I made, I made one at work the other day, but then I remembered no one there plays it. So I made the, I made the reference. Uh, uh. Did you want to do something, by the way, Jed? Because you've been saying fuck yes. shit like the entire time. Yes. I'm, I'm looking for any beasts who have dark vision to polymorph it. Ah, okay. But none of them are like fun. I mean, I, 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 I get strong. Just pick up a rock. I mean, you can make this light up, can't you? Oh yes. Fuck the shit. I 
pick up a look, uh, rock. <laughs> How the fuck do you forget that? I <laughs> because uh, I don't want to have too much light to get Sekudai. Well, then just you can literally cover it up. Yes. I'm taking a rock and casting light. Okay. But, but there's nothing wrong with like, he- sending it like ahead of us so we're not in the light, but we can see ahead of us. Yes. So no. you're into the yeah. mine? Oh, Moria. Into the mine. Into the mine, we go. Cool. <coughs> Sorry, I had something in my throat. Into the mine. <laughs> oh, God, no. no. Her voice isn't that high. No, no, no. no, no. <laughs> Let's not do that. Let's not. Just not. Even, even worse, even worse. He starts talking in the same voice as Freddie Highmore. Oh, God, no. You know, the guy who plays the good doctor, I discovered, like, because I'm on season four now, which is like the, the first few episodes are all, all about the corona crisis. Oh, yeah. oh shit. And <laughs> at a certain point, like, I think the, because the, the first two are a double feature. I think at the end of the second one, he actually, you know, uh, takes the, uh, the word at the end of the episode to express his thanks to everyone in the healthcare in his British voice. And he sounds like a 40 year old lad. It's like, Holy shit. Like a 14 year old lad going off to eat in uh, at some point. Liam. That Sorry. kind of English. Yeah, I know what you mean, yeah. <laughs> Annoying. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have a map to share, Lars? No, not yet. Yeah. The, you the worst thing about it is Liam. <laughs> Why could I going into the mind? Once right. you've heard his natural accent. You start, you start picking up the moments he slightly drops the American accent in the show. So it's like, ah, oh, fuck, there, <laughs> there goes my disp- the suspense of disbelief. There it is. Sorry, I yeah. was quickly <laughs> setting something up. Sorry. Okay. Um, all right, so you guys walk into... Yeah, don't worry about it. It has nothing to do with you people. Mm-hmm. Um, why would I lie about that? Um... <laughs> So as you um, walk into the mine, you kind of see, you know, you have to go down for a little bit, a good, you know, five to ten minutes, at which point you end up in this large kind of like opening room. Uh, You see that there's kind of like a couple of cart tracks that are going in several directions. One, uh, this would be from your perspective to the west, to the north and to the east. Um, You do get the sense that the one to the north is like a lot bigger and then the west and the east are kind of like side corridors that they they yes. cut out later down the line um but yeah so, yeah so like strip mining one big tunnel with like, lots leading off oh, it's, like, it's, yeah. it's like i can't see you it's dark where are you i'm over here here here, here. so um, could i'm you actually be... like right next to you but yeah uh, okay <laughs> <laughs> Could you uh, do your primeval demon searching stuff? I could. Do you want to do it though? Do you want to build a snowman? No. No. Don't do this too large. Yeah, I kind of forgot about it. As I said it, I realized I'm like, ah, right, oh, too late. (laughs) Uh, well, instead of that, why don't we just go that way into the unknown? Um, <laughs> okay. Sorry. <laughs> uh, no, I, I, I can do that. Um, that's probably a good idea, actually. I will <laughs> use I will use my uh, first level and use that. Okay. What's the range? A mile. A mile. Okay. Um... I will say this. You do not immediately pick up on a demonic creature. You do, however, get a sort of demonic <clears throat> sense. Let me put it like that. It's not, it's, not, it's not just demons. I can detect a lot of things in this barrel, which yeah, I forgot about. But I am specifying... Aber- aberrations, celestials, dragons, elementals, fey, fiends, or undead. Do you detect all of those with this? Yep. Or any of them. At the same time? Yeah. Oh, okay. It, it didn't say all, it's just any of those. Then yes, I should probably add something to that. You also detect Ooh. elementals. Ah, uh, yeah, it's a mine, so yeah. 
Huh. Well, maybe not, actually. Maybe they delve too greedily and too deep. There's a Balrog <laughs> at the end of this, yes. <laughs> what yeah, if the stones yeah. that's regrowing are just earth elements? Yeah, but, dude, that's that's not fair. If there's a Balrog at the end of this, we need to get have uh, one of the NR as our friend. That's how this works. Well, no, no. to be fair, it's if there's a Balrog, the... we can get rid of it easily. I mean, we have a wizard. Yeah, I'm too young to be gathered. But he's not on an hour, so, you know. <laughs> but, you know, we're just saying that Jed is going to get white hair. That's just what we're saying. <laughs> right, so if, if we find a bridge spanning a chasm, <laughs> make yes. make sure Jed's at the back. Then just okay? fly, you fools. <laughs> Do you have the fly spell? Um, yes. I have. He has find familiar. Find, find an eagle. There you go. I don't have fight familiar. Fuck fight oh, familiar. Damn it. Well, what use are you then? <laughs> so, what are you oh. doing? Uh, obviously, which direction did I detect these? Uh, north. All, all of them. The slight demonic sense and the elemental. Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, that way appears to have some form of elemental mm. energy. That way, in north, straight ahead. You can't see, so straight ahead. Boys, let's loot the sideways then. So side missions first, then main story. Gotcha. Yes. yes. I like your thinking. Yes. <clears throat> are you? Stay focused. Huh? Okay, so where are you going first? I'm just like leaning against the wall constantly until we start moving again. East? East? Yes. You sure? Yes. You very sure? No. Okay. The less said east. Good to know. Um, I, I, he said east, so that's what it made. Uh, immediately I'll go that way. Okay. That way being east or? East, yes. Okay. You know, for all you know, then it's like, we're going east and you just travel west because you, you know, you. I mean, I mean, I mean I'm usually the, the, the scout on at the front, so that's so I immediately go first. So um, I got a, I got a directive thing. Out of sheer curiosity, what's the marching order for this? Well, you know, is it you know, you can front. walk uh, two by two, but that's the best you can do. I'm probably going to be like in the middle, then I guess. Yeah, I, I am. However, the, the second that we decide to go that way, uh, I am going to pop a uh, pass without trace. Okay. Uh, I'll I've be on second as well. Oh. oh, I have disadvantage anyway. No, nothing, nothing changes for me. Uh, okay, my Google Chrome decides to die. Great. So, Shiloh, you want to be up front oh. or second Wait. row? I mean, uh, I'm always behind Ryu, so. <laughs> so you want to be last? Yes. I'll be the front row wizard then. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fine. The I'll only reason why fine. I don't want to be completely in front is because I have disadvantage on everything. So I'm not going to. If I need to make perception checks or investigation checks or anything, then yeah, we're fucking if you dying. don't have disadvantage on everything, you still yeah. have disadvantage on everything. Let's be honest here. <laughs> True. But do you have comes, three, comes three points? Yes. Hmm? I have three points of exhaustion. Three. <laughs> Lingering. Oh, yeah. So checks and attacks and. Th yeah, yeah, everything. Yeah. Yeah. We're also so, moving around slowly. Yeah, so I'm up, I'm up front with who, sorry? Shiloh. Of Valkyrie. Shiloh. Oh, yes. Okay. Right. So, sec so Valkyrie's getting another stealth mission. Yes. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> well, we're all here, just use at the front, so... Okay, yeah. cool. All right. It'll count as that. Sorry, I haven't eaten in 24 hours. <laughs> Fair. So as you go into the eastern corridor, it's pretty long, um, and at first you don't really see anything specific. Then at a certain point in time, Sakura and Elvakri are up front, right? So the mm -hmm. two of you are the first to see this. You actually see a um, body lying on the floor. Nice. That's not, what do you mean nice? That's not good. <laughs> this guy, oh, we see a body. Nice. Is it uh, a dead body? Yes. Than one minute. Yes. I, I don't know if that's um, any minute. Yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> Not nice. Um, yeah. Is it dwarf? Uh, this one would be human. human. Would have like um, a miner's outfit though. And do I see? Would I see any kind of like signs of uh, 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 like natural cause? Yeah, let me like let me ask you this death. question: How close do you want to come? Um, I mean, I'm gonna, I'll get within ten feet of it. Okay. Uh, you see that this being, let's yes. let's put it like that, is like f- uh, face yeah. first into the dirt. Yes, cat, indeed. There's a dead person. <laughs> Mm-hmm. is like face first into the dirt and you see kind of like a little bit of the miner's outfit um make an investigation check okay. book it 19 well booked as you kind of like look at it you notice that like one of his arms is like slightly free and you notice how the arm is still there, but there's portions of it that seem to be like this dark, dark blackish brown of color, and they seem to be dripping. Those specific areas seem to just be dripping. Hmm. Um, he's leaking. Um, I'm gonna oh, play no. off Akri here. Yeah, I'm not gonna say that out loud, but I did type it in chat. Can she? <laughs> can, can can no idea what the tap uh, file of the body fluid, since she always wants to do that in case it's. Yeah, she does always. Yeah, Akri does Tell always do what, that. Since I'm at the front and walking into this, uh, we're we're still in the entrance of the mine, right? We're no, no, we're you would have traveled to the uh, the eastern. Uh, pathway at this point. Right. We're yeah, still we on the pathway. The east, okay. We went to the east tunnel. Yeah, indeed. So we're at the tunnel to to, to go in there. You're uh, already yeah. some ways into we're the in, tunnel. At this point. Yeah. It. Okay. Um, what I'll do is actually um, turn on my thingy to detect thingies. Divine sense. Yes. Thank you. That's the one. Um, as you do that, you do sense a demonic presence from kind of this pretty much from the whole body um hmm. is, is, is there anything else around any do we signs just, of like, anything a demonic body make a perception check Sakura. Twenty-one. Twenty-one. Not that you can immediately see. There's a dead body. Get the sense he's like face first. There's slightly damaged miner's clothes, and there's these like there's a couple of these spots that you can see. The but fluid, just the fluids. one body. Yeah. The fluids that are leaking. Could I identify them as blood or? Uh, do you have your light? Do you have your light on, Chip? Yes. Okay, make an invest. Uh, actually, yeah, make an investigation check. Okay. <coughs> Guide me. Uh, well, you the the blessed. Bless you. I got guidance on him. Okay, thank you. He's like, oh God, oh, bless you. Imagine every single time he casts like guidance, he now casts bless instead. Good. Actually, do I have bless? Uh, yeah, I do have it prepared. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just casting gardens though. Uh, 12 to. Uh, I'm gonna spend the bullshit point on it. Alright. I wanna get 15. Opa, 16. 16. Opa. You kind of like look at it relatively closely with the light. Uh, it's not blood, it seems to be mud. Oh, it's leaking mud. That's. Out of his body? <clears throat> Is it turning into an elemental? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I sure. Maybe maybe try and clean it. Can can you like clean it with magic? Press the digitation. Press the digitation. See what the wound is like. Okay. Uh-huh. The mud 
disappeared. Hmm. And so we're not we're not at the end of the tunnel. Are we? We're nope. sort of Indeed. so it, it carries on. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna just go around the body and try and keep going to see what else is down there. Okay. You go first, Sakura. As you go. We travel a bit further, and the deeper in you go, the more of these bodies that you start seeing. Um, at this point, since you're seeing more and more of these bodies, there is one thing that you notice they all have in common. They all seem to be running from something. Because all of them are kind of like with their head towards the direction that you came from. Some of them are like face up, most of them face down, and all of them, not a single exception, have these mud places that are kind of like leaking slightly. So they were running from something. So there's something at the end of this. And from the one that we like cleaned the wound, is it still coming out slowly or is it just completely stopped like no, it's leaking? Gone. Like is the wound still there, or is the wound also gone? There would be, like, you know, a wound of and, and like, kind of dried up blood now, pretty much. Mm. Mm. I press the digitate everyone you come across. Like, just the Here back. Okay. Okay. A lot of the wounds that you see are mostly just, like, these large bruises, broken bruises. ankles, broken necks, broken whatever. Ooh. Broken necks a little different than the broken ankle ones. <laughs> <laughs> I said most of the wounds. I mean, some of those were yeah, fatal. Yeah. Some of some of them were were not. Yeah. Okay. It's just kind of funny how you compare them to each other. It's like, oh, broken, broken ankle, broken neck. <laughs> yeah, it's both broken. God damn it. Broken skull. Broken eye sockets. Uh, broken uh, jet. I mean, uh... <laughs> to be continued. So, um, let's head forward. Question mark. Um, would we have been traveling for more than a mile already? Mm. The moment you kind of reach the end of the tunnel, because at one point you would reach the end, you would be at about a mile. Okay. So we're reaching the end and we haven't encountered this mm -hmm. mud leaking yep. monster. You also but notice everyone... at the end that there's like. There's, this is like where the largest concentration of people is. Um, they were clearly taken by surprise, and you actually still see a couple of pickaxes like kind of stuck within the wall. You also get the sense that some of these pickaxes have kind of like started, like have stone kind of like form around them for some weird reason. Uh, okay. Okay. Cool. 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 I think uh, so too, Jake. Mm -hmm. Fuck. Maybe okay. there isn't a monster here. It's just mm -hmm. there. Yeah. Maybe we all need to just go back to the inn and sleep for a couple days. You cannot sleep it off, Ryan. Gamble? <laughs> you cannot Addiction? sleep it off. <laughs> no. All right, what Hobby. happened in my absence? <laughs> so, we've reached the end of the tunnel. No monsters inside. Everyone died. Yeah, everybody but, dies. Uh, all, all the miners. Yes, yeah. all the miners. Uh, with an E. With an E, not an O. E, 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 E. So, um, whatever uh, no. they were running away from is not there anymore. Hmm. Or not well. at this moment. Could uh, I well, it, would, it, it makes sense that they, they, they've gone yeah. up to the north. Yeah. Whatever Could I it ritual was. cast detect magic on the end of the tunnel to see if there's anything magical remaining? Not that I guess, but... You want a ritual cast detect magic? Yes. Yeah, sure. Go for it. You have minutes. We, we've had illusory rules before. Yep. Twice. What? Are you saying yes. I have a pattern? Uh, once in the level one fight with the wizard that caused Tarnus. Yeah, I remember that one. I don't remember that one. And once in the wizard tower, the last session. Yeah. 
That we know of. Mm-hmm. That we know of. The, the, yeah, the, the, this is where this is where Lars reveals. Now there was actually six more. One of the like two of them had like massive treasure rooms with legendary items in it, but you didn't find it. So I'm, I'm still surprised you guys missed that Vor- Vorpal sword, to be honest. But yeah, <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um, That's a sword. After uh, ten minutes with the uh, detect magic, um, honestly, what you would detect is very similar to what Shiloh and and and, and all would have detected it, and Sekiro would have detected at this point. Just a demonic influence. Okay. okay. Nothing specific. Good. So, do we directly want to head north, face I, the danger head on, or I, go I west? A, I have a feeling that. We'll just find more of the same in the West Tunnel, considering what I detected was in the north. I didn't even sense anything these ways. Yeah. Unfortunately, I think there's just more of the same. It... Oh, sadness. <clears throat> so, um, about elementals, what do we know about? They are uh, immune to... Look. Wh- whatever element they are, they are likely immune to. And yeah. probably have some form of defense against whatever they're usually weak to. Not all of them, but yeah. that's as far as I know. Um, and I've they never really do tangled not with them. Have fucking souls. I'm more concerned about making sure no, no more innocents die. Yeah. Yeah. I think uh, we should go the into this justify the means. <laughs> <laughs> Let's head north then. I'll pretend I didn't hear that. Well, so you're going I'm, back. I'm a somewhat you... crusade inspired paladin. Yes. Yeah. Um, I will say uh, the pass without trace would still be active. It's while like you go. Constantinople. Yeah, I, don't know I, know if I do. think you can I'm technically gonna... travel three miles before that goes away and you'd be one, two. So you'd still have it. It's, it's up to an hour. Yeah, which an hour of travel is, I think, three miles yeah. usually, unless you go yeah, fast. Okay. So. so you'd be. So... Yeah. Let's go cool. stealthily. Okay. Yep. Everybody yeah, roll a stealth. stealth check. Everybody okay. roll some stealth. Plus ten. Right, plus ten, yeah. Yep. Disadvantage. If I could roll a thirteen and a sixteen, so oh. it's like twenty five. I rolled a four, so how's a thirty six? <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, I'll even it out. I have a twelve. Uh sorry, thirty five. I actually put Twelve instead of a. Uh, so you have two twelves for your stealth checks. That's totally not going to bite you. Yes. Um, the balance didn't roll really high as okay. expected. So the I actually dropped a fifteen. Fuck. I think the average is like twenty five or twenty six because it's all Valkyrie's roll. So okay. <laughs> anyway, uh, as you go towards the north entrance, um, every now and again you do see like you know as you travel through this you see like a small side thing where they started cutting and then maybe stopped. Sometimes it's a little longer. But overall, those areas, apart from every now and again, a new, you know, dead miner, uh, which you had seen before, uh, don't really reveal anything special. Okay, uh, same de- a dead type miner of in an underground room. space. Mm-hmm. However, as you, you're getting at like the 55 minute mark of, of Pass Without Trace at this point. Boom, boom, boom. Um, who was up front? Sekwida and me. Okay. Uh, Sekura, make a perception check for me, if you please. Please make it a high. Roll, roll a high number. Big number. Big whammy. That is a big four. It's, it's a pretty big number. Um, with your with your dark vision and with looking through, like make, being very careful about everything that's going on. Um, at a certain point in time, you know, you notice how as you go more and more north, you get the sense that the space starts kind of like getting like the corridor that you're traveling through gets closer and closer together. Mm. And at a certain point in time, you start looking and you swear to God that you see something move. At which point yeah. you get a little it's closer. <laughs> yeah. Uh, at which point you get a little closer and you actually, the same mud that you'd seen on all these beings, you actually see it sitting there on the wall and dripping. Oh, great. The walls are bleeding. Nature is healing. Uh, 
and you go a little further and you see another spot and it seems that the further and the deeper you travel in the more of these like little spots start to appear can i also press the digitate not this time um there are magical spots of but jed how far away can you send your light up stone i don't know how far as far as he can throw it yes literally that actually Sakrida, here, yeah, yeah, another okay. stone. Take this one, throw it to the distance. You hang it. I'm just going to tear a piece of one of my, the, the, the leather straps from my armor, which has oh, sort yes. of come yes. loose from combat anyway. I'm going to grab the stone that he has lit up and attach it to the front of an arrow and then just fire it. I can also cast light on your arrow, you know. Yeah, I was about to say. Why did you wait until I do <laughs> He rips off like pieces of Why does that remind me of thing. like Narnia? And, like, and then he just fucking touches the arrow. <laughs> Isn't that a scene in like the second Narnia movie where like he's like making a torch and he's like, does anyone have a lighter? You know, I do have a flashlight with me. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know where you were going with this sequida. I was like, uh, hey, such uh, a okay, weird... <laughs> What if I cast light what? on the arrow? I'm going on walkabout with you guys. <sighs> and now I'm, and I'm just holding a brightly lit arrow uh, with a dull stone on the end now. And I just angrily take it off. <sighs> Fine. Okay, this new lit up arrow, and then going to fire along the corridor. All right. Just directly ahead. Cool. So you take the arrow, you shoot, and it goes through. And it keeps going for pretty, a pretty long while. Uh, I'm just gonna roll randomly. Cool. Keeps it going. It doesn't. It doesn't have a maximum range, does it? Six hundred like feet. Six hundred feet. <laughs> oh no, the the lights. Oh, the light. Around. No, it it just stays on the object. And oh, it's just it's just object, right? Yeah. And now we're long. So okay. it keeps flying too, and at a certain point in time, it you notice how this corridor has gotten really like smashed together, and it goes right through there. And you notice how it's almost like this arc of this like strange mud that seems to be like clicking down the entire time. And then it opens up a little bit again, not very far, and you can still like barely walk with like two next to one another. But you do notice that this mud seems to like, at this point, there's like an actual, not, not like a wall, but like a an arch that's like almost just entirely made of this mud that if you want to continue you would have to get past let's use the advantage of a laptop i can do yes. this um it's gonna sound weird but let's attack the mud uh i'd, I'd, rather, the not, I'd rather not touch that stuff if i'm honest do you want to walk through it did my arrow go through it yes that doesn't actually tell me much, other than that it's not. <laughs> other than it's not a solid wall. Yeah, it could just be like a thick other layer. It could be like a thin thing. We don't know. Sequilla, yeah, but it, it's, 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 more the, it's more the fact. The yeah, okay. It's more the fact that it wasn't a living creature that went through it. Mm-hmm. What's was the question? Uh, Charlotte. Yeah. Sorry. Did he take it to the knee? Yes. No. <laughs> okay, so it's not an adventurer anymore. Yes, indeed. It's not an adventure anymore. <laughs> so, uh... Does that mean it lost its soul? Possibly. <laughs> Use a bonus action to oh, find I saw, out. I saw. <laughs> bonus action soul grab for that. Nope, doesn't do anything. Last, I cast Ice Knife on the archway. Okay. You I cast dead. the Ice Knife. I mean, it's mud. It's not going to dodge it. <laughs> you see this like slight explosion of ice. And you see how, like, a large portion of the mud is just frozen over right now. And I'm Let's just like, it. thanks for the ice. Yes. Go, 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 go. Okay, then, then I... I I'm going to, like, do that weird thing where you sort of stand on, like, the edge of something and just do a really quick hop over the, th- over the threshold. I'm going to do one better. I'm going to, like, as I want to pass, I'm going to cast uh, Bless on... Uh, I can do up to like how, how many people fucking 
three, 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 isn't it? three at first level, four at second level, and so on and so forth. Yeah, I'm just gonna do three. So I'm gonna pass it on uh, me, Shiloh, and who else would need it the most for like? Oh fuck. Yeah, but Valkyrie isn't here, so I'm gonna Shy. cast it on. <laughs> Either Sekiro or you, then. I'll cast it on Eeny Meeny Miny Miny. Catch a tiger by the toe if he bites and let him go. Sekuda. Okay. Yay. Um, so me, Shiloh, and Sekuda have, have Bless, and with the Bless, I want to use the 10 feet movement that I can do to not get an opportunity uh, attack. I don't know if that helps at all, and just fucking fly through quickly as I like. It does not, but hey. Um, I will say, with the Ice Knife, it would have stopped the mud to a certain extent yes. so i will give you guys advantage on the next thing that i'm gonna ask uh but i would like all of you to make a dexterity saving throw Oof. oh and with some people get a bless bonus yep. so it doesn't matter yeah no the oh, 10, the the ten feet didn't like matter the, the bless did yeah yeah, yeah. So, if i fail the dexterity uh, saving throw does it mean i drop the laptop Yes. Uh, <laughs> no, that's Since Oh, I... by the way, you also all get the bonus from Shiloh, by the way. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. So, so I have oh, disadvantage, oh, okay. but so I have advantage, so it cancels out, yeah? Yeah, straight roll. All right, straight well, roll. Do we all have advantage? Uh, yes, you all have advantage on the deck save. Oh, wait, how okay. much, oh, how much is the bonus from Shiloh? Plus three. Three. Plus three. Uh, three. So hang on. 16. Um, Lars, I'm gonna use my ability uh, Arcane 16. Deflection to give me another plus 4 for a 20 total. Uh, okay. I'm gonna use uh, two points of my anchor, which is all of them, to get me yeah. a d6. <clears throat> I didn't know I had advantage I rolled again, so it ended what up with 27. You're speaking elvish? <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, sorry. Yes. yes, it is. Oh my god, it's a 1, are you kidding me? Well, that's a 12 total. Fuck. So, Ryu, did you add Shiloh's bonus? Uh, plus yeah, three. that's uh, plus three, yeah. Ah, okay. So, 12 for Ryu. Uh, Sekuda, way too fucking high. Jed, 27. way too fucking high. Shiloh, 13 plus three, so 16 then, I'm guessing. Does anyone else need <laughs> I can understand that, Shiloh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't understand Jed. Yeah, and Ulfakri makes it too. Uh, so that means Ryu is the only one who fails it. <laughs> oh, yeah. uh, a lingering know, point of exhaustion. Uh, yeah, you take another lingering point. Of... No, I'm kidding. Um... So he takes a lingering point of failed death save. So. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Not again. How about you keep going through all, and I'll sell. I'll tell you when you're right. How about that? Oh, okay. He gets a lingering point of drunk. <laughs> uh, lingering point. That's of... you. <laughs> oh yeah, that's me. A uh, lingering point yes. of um, you. You have a permanent uh, mud stain advantage on all charisma checks. I was going to say a lingering point of incompetence, but he's he's had that from his, from birth. Ah! Uh, <laughs> Actually, okay, no, lingering jokes point on of you. Impotence. I did have it from birth. I was dropped. Ha. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, fine. You get a bullshit point for that one. Uh, <laughs> no, um, Ryu, as you. Halfway move, halfway fly through this uh, entrance. I'm like imagining you just like go like your face first and you kind of just like flip over entirely to get through it. <laughs> like I'm imagining that for some weird reason. Yeah, so it's like... <laughs> you fly um, face first into the ice. You do, you do get this like spot of mud on you. Mm. And it touches you and you... it. it doesn't necessarily immediately feel painful, but it feels cold. And you oh, get the God. sense that it kind of like seeps into your skin a little bit. Uh, no. And uh, you do get a lingering point. Uh, you get a lingering point of minus one to your saves. Oh, so disadvantage and a minus one. <laughs> yes. Wow. Oh, it's it's oh if you... fuck me. Why did it go down me. here? All right. It's fine. But, um, so what you're saying is I brought slicing weapons to a mud fight. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I if, brought piercing weapons right. and slicing well, technically weapons. The, technically, the halberd, the halberd can be used for piercing damage as well. You get a bullshit point for that. But that's also sure. useless in this case, so yeah. I, it's beautiful. Uh, if it's mud we're fighting, I am useless. Yep, I don't same. particularly care. 
I um, found a fight like where I can't... spells against mud. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I have some smites that could work. You can I certainly can. Try. I I can uh, I, I can put a mark on it. You can certainly try. Mm. But as you uh, keep it's, walking uh, on through uh, the corridor, you see the mud kind of at this point, like almost like just watered, like dripping off of the wall <laughs> constantly. Uh, currently, you do not have to make any saves, but that might change in the future. Uh, but we'll keep that for next time. Seeing as two of you yeah. need to go to bed. <laughs> yeah, I need to Fair be ready enough. <laughs> Thank you, lads. You're That's welcome. Such... I just Thank wanted you. to finish the arch and then I was going to quit. I get it. I'm gonna die next session. I have like again. I'm so fucked. I'm yeah. so fucked. But you will unlock the third level. I mean, of with lightning, you might be able to do something. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I cast bless on you guys. Yeah, so uh, I mean, I'm just I think... I'm just hoping that it's not gonna be immune to lightning damage because it's mud, and I'm because that's gonna be sad. <laughs> I, fair, I I do have searing smite, and technically, divine smite would still work if it's a demon. That damage would still go through, even if the slashing damage does fuck all. You can I certainly have, drive. I have uh, a pot. <laughs> and a kettle. And the one is calling uh, the other black. I have... Oh, wait, Jesus. no. Uh, oh. <gasps> Rayu. Oh, thinking outside huh? the box here. I can polymorph you. Can I, Would that can still I give actually... you points? Yeah, it still gives you lingering points and it still yeah. gives you disadvantage on your save. Can I, uh, can I actually make make someone else's weapon magical if I if I use my magic weapon on it. Yep. Yes. Think so. That might work, Liam. True. But we will see all of that and next, next time. Bye. 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 Bye.